is the first Sunday of August on my way to the shady car lot for the monthly tour see what junk they got now, it's been a couple of days since I made any videos but hopefully we'll make up for that here in just a bit a nice looking sunrise I might try to get a shot of that if I can anyway we are here so let's check out the junk they have this month and we got ourselves a Beamer convertible Z3 about ready to drive out of here probably almost could fit through the gap in the post there is it unlocked? no it is locked huh pretty fancy but again, I wouldn't trust it. Big old Vortec 2500. Of course, the door is open. Ooh, isn't that precious? Um, <laughs> okay. So we got all sorts of little, little coatings in here of precious little lakes and stuff. Isn't that something? Wow. Well, I got a little girly touch to it, I guess. I don't know. That's different. Nice console. Got seat covers, probably covering up the ripped seats. Let's see what we got under here. Oh yeah, we got a rip there. Eh, I'm afraid to look any further. Okay, we got all sorts of carpet on the... Looks like new carpet on the floor. Yeah, look, and even some more lace there if you can see it. Look, you can tell. What kind of get up is this? Wow. Okay, well, Tri-City Automotive in Eden, North Carolina. Huh, isn't that interesting? Oh, a little lacy. 2500 with a golf ball in the back. Awesome. Uh, some little Ranger Danger with deer heads on the back. I ain't even gonna look in there. What? Well, why not? It's for shits and giggles when we got in the old... Danger Ranger. Yeah. Overall, not too bad, actually. Got ourselves a dream catcher. Catching them our dreams with a crack windshield. Yeah, the crack is raw our Beautiful. Yep, yeah, we got dream catchers and deer heads. Okay. Nice combo. Whatever. Ram 2500. What we got in here? Let's see. 4x4. Four four. Uh it don't look too bad. And overall, huh, this one is actually pretty nice. Doesn't smell too awful bad. Huh. Interesting. Uh, seen its days on the farm, though, it looks like. Yeah, got the old fifth wheel. Of course, the fifth wheel is not even here, but they got this little gate. You know, half gate, whatever you normally see on a fifth wheel. Old Chevrolet, regular cab, another regular cab with themselves, the old swordfish on the back window. Still got the old avalanche here. There must be something seriously wrong with this one. It's been here a while. So, huh. I mean, I don't know. Console. Blown out seat. Boy, that would help sell. Maybe the sunroof leaks. Hell, that wouldn't be surprising. Huh. Um, what does that say? VIN not readable. That's probably why. <laughs> we got to have a readable VIN number there. Uh, another long dead third. Ourselves a old Chevrolet. This is actually a regular, let's see, extended cab. This doesn't even have, yeah, it does have a door on it, actually. Is it open? Does it? No, well, maybe it doesn't. Oh, that's an extended cab. Sure enough, yeah, it ain't coming open. Wow. Got all sorts of snot rags in there. Perfect. That'll help sell. A little flu season. Probably not too far off. Hmm. Regular long bed. Third. Oh boy. Got ourselves some leftover 7-Eleven in here. How about that, boys and girls? Wings. 
Awesome. Ebo leftover bone wings in the in the pasture seat. All reclined back. Perfect. <laughs> How much are they asking for it? Fifty nine fifty. Wing bones included. Perfect. What else we got? Oh, a little gas can. I must have ran out of gas. How about that? Debris on the ground. Oh, we got ourselves some winch straps. Oh, aren't those nice? Another long bed. A regular cab. Furred. Blown out seat. That sells a little bottle cap. Another crack windshield. That's typical here in South Kakalaki because we do not have vehicle inspections. Huh. That's some nice looking winch straps. Uh, we got here. Got ourselves a Dodge four door. Let's check out the back door. Yeah, a little bit of hmm, stainage on the seats. Okay. Still got the cracked driver's side window. Yeah. Overall, not too awful bad. Yeah, we've got some cracked windshield, cracked driver's side glass. Perfect. What a deal. Regular cab. Another regular cab. Uh, we got ourselves a front. Uh, that's an explorer. I thought it was a frontier. Uh, there is just not much room in the back of these things. All sorts of room for going on road trips. I guess that's probably what these would be good for. I mean, they're not bad vehicles overall, but you can't haul nothing. That's for damn sure, unless you got a trailer. Missing console. Perfect. How much are we asking for this one? Thirty-nine hundred. Evil. Yeah. Let's see what we got, huh? Hmm. Got some wires in the floor. Yep. Open console. Perfect. Yeah. I mean, overall, not too awful bad. Something like this would probably be good south of the border. Oh, a proud parent of a Marine. Well, must not have taken care of their vehicle because it's stuck here now. What do we got? Yeah, not too bad, the old Dodge. It smells pretty good in here. Maybe they covered up the cigarette smoke or whatever. Got ourselves a blown out driver's seat and not much else happening there. Wow, what in the hell is going on there? Scruffy looking dude in a shopping cart. Pushing their women along. Okay. Some weird folks out this morning. Thought I'd get out early enough to beat some of the freaks. But no, no. Okay. Work hard, trust God, anvil on the back of this here Dodge. Okay. We got ourselves a spotter included on this here truck. Look, you can tell it's Charlotte's Web. Evil. Got ourselves a spider. What do we got? Eh, you now this one does still kind of reek of smoke. I think they did all right trying to get rid of the smell, but no, the stench is still there. Eh, beautiful. Yeah, it looks like dudes are pushing their women around in the shopping carts. I guess uh, that's the new, the new thing. Or whatever. Okay. A long bed. Another Chevy. Sold. Oh yeah. Why is it still here then if it's sold? Um, yeah, missing stereo. Yeah. Pleth pleather. Plush pleather. Interior. Okay. Interesting.
find ourselves a Z71 with a kicked up rail bar. Are we asking for that? I can't really. 4500. Busted windshield. Perfect. This one's probably a cross between uh, cigarette smoke and pine scent. Beautiful. What a great mixture. Yeah, that's something. And we got ourselves another Nissan. Not much room there. A coder. A Dodge coder with uh, some sort of nappy wig in the back or something. I don't know. Okay. Trans P. That must be a transmission problem. A blown out driver's seat. And passenger seat. And it reeks of smoke. And we got all sorts of things hanging down. Yeah, this one reeks. Yep. Can't even mess with that. Old Dodge Coder. Thought about getting one of these before I got my Dodge Ram. Wow. This one reeks even worse. Just leave the doors open to air it out at least. Good God. Yeah, headliner's coming down. Yeah. Perfect. The plane. The plane. Sells redneck Chevy. Got one little rail bar there. Toolbox is gone. Looks like it may have had some sort of spray in liner, but whatever happened to it, I don't know. There's nothing in the regular bit. Oh yeah, this one with the custom console box. Okay. Probably got the baby launcher console there. Uh, precious. Blown out seat. Um, rigged up AM FM CD, crack dash. Okay, as far as the windshield didn't crack. 2950. Yep, buddy. Yep. Even got the coffin style thumbtack headliner uh, design going on here. Beautiful. Alrighty then. And let's see what we got going on down here. Yeah. There's a couple more trucks, a regular cab. Got ourselves a tar. A work van. 3950. Another big old third. It's just a regular cab. I really don't care about the regular cabs. Oh, how about that? Okay. Guess they must have ran over this one too many times. <laughs> okay. Yep. Yeah. What do we got here? The old 4x4. 3950. Got rust. Now well, we know where that must have come from. What does this say? K edge something, I don't know. Scratched in it. Perfect. Okay. And wow. So we got some garbage bags filling the headrest here. Well, isn't that different? Okay. Um not much else too fancy about this one. Other than uh yeah, you open up the door. Oh yeah, we're all cancered out down here. Rockers are gone. Nice and rusty. Yeah. Yep, you know that came from up north. Perfect. Yep. Send them down south where we don't know any better. I guess that's the mentality. Yeah, I don't know. But underneath this tailgate there's probably all sorts of cancered out rust as well. And there's some rust on the frame. Let's see what this rocket looks like. Oh yeah, it's gone. Look at that. Beautiful. Jeez. Yeah, forget that. Thing will fall apart, break in half on the road. Let's see what other junk we got down here. Got some windows down on the old beamer. Oh man. The wheels alone have got to make it worth selling. Some note in the door, some crap. Oh, we got ourselves a Pepsi Cola and a speaker, door panel. Oh, must have ripped out some shit here. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Perfect. Trans P. I guess that's a transmission problem. Yeah, that's worth the sale, whatever they're asking. Okay. Uh, 
anything else of value to look at just beamers and audis and mazdas and volkswagens more beamers just a lot of german junk here on the lot yeah more volkswagens more beamers my goodness some suvs over here yeah, got some sort of Another one of these compact Ford Explorer trucks. Mercedes. Of course, we've got to have Mercedes in a row. Perfect. This one don't look too bad. Uh, same missing console. Oh, we've got to sell some new floor mats down here. Boy, that's got to add some value. Seat cover. Yeah, anything in the console? Yeah. Looks pretty empty. Sunroof. Ooh. Um, don't know what they're asking for this one. Can't see it on the price. I mean, overall, yeah, blowing out seat. It's got some use to it. Oh, it's got the old extension gate. Oh, back door's not open. Damn. Uh, 2950 Mazda. Let's see if this one's open. Of course it is. Yeah, new floor mats. Got some sort of air freshener in here as well. Something like that. I don't know. Yeah. Huh? Not bad. Step bars. Little Ferret Explorer. Okay, let's see. Nothing worth walking down that way. We'll walk by the old Mazda here, 2950. Old Sportster. Wow, it could actually fit in the back seat, huh? How about that? Let's see the inside of this just for shits and giggles. Uh, we got ourselves some sort of kick panel on the floor. E brake, I guess, for your slides. Uh, Okay, that's a weird looking console shaped like a disc. And not too bad. Not much room. Sunroof left open while it's raining. Perfect. Well, looks like they've cleared out some junk. A little busted chair underneath the tree there. Wow, a lot of open space today. Huh. We've got ourselves a, what the hell is this, some kind of alien, Space Tribe, Silverton Mountain, Rod, Colorado, Alaska, North to the Future, Keep Charlotte Weird, East Coast Fighter, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, okay, I'll take your word that you done good in there, wow, yeah, they cleared out a lot of junk. This car's been sitting there for a while. You can tell by the bare spots in the grass. How about that? Boy, that's, uh, that's impressive. Yeah. Wow, there's one that had a tree growing under it. I managed to get wheeled out of there. Probably hauled off for scrap. Oh, we got a Toyota. Looks like a Toyota Sienna buried back there. Well, that's actually a Mazda. That's a Mazda minivan. It almost looked like a Sienna. Surprised they didn't haul this hunk of junk out yet. Old Beamer getting growed up over. Some Volkswagens. Got a Durango. Volvo. Yeah, it looks like they finally started to move some stuff. Oh, we got ourselves a Autobot. Really? Nobody cares about your stick figure family. You know, I kind of have to agree with that, honestly. Pass you, I will. Perfect. Okay, I'll make you my thumbnail. Pertimus. Okay. The skeeters are flying around, so i got to keep moving. Well, how about that? They cleared out this lot, or section of the lot as well. Walk past the old mud hole. Sorts of debris, bottles. Yeah. Nice beamer. Not too far from being hauled off for scrap, probably. Yeah, beautiful, nice window, got all sorts of parts to piece it back together like a jigsaw puzzle, yeah, good luck with that, uh, mud hole, got some butter cups all through the scrap yard here, what else we got over here, another hunk of junk with the whole front end missing, hmm, perfect. Another SUV. All the chairs are getting covered over. 
<laughs> see what else we got here. There's another truck over our proud Navy mom. Yeah. Guess you weren't proud enough to take care of your vehicle. I got an Xterra, a little bullet hole or rust hole, something. Yeah. Junk in the trunk, or in the console, really. Got some nasal spray ball. Yeah. Gonna suck that shit. Oh boy. This one's apparently got a motor problem. It says so on the winder. Another old redneck Chevy. Nice wheel. Boy, that's gotta be worth something. Low brakes, you think? I don't think it's got much in the way of parts either. <laughs> Gee. Should have hauled this one off for scrap. What else we got? Nothing else of value. Motor. Oh, motor's bad. This here Mazda Speed. Okay. Yeah, it's probably definitely not worth fixing. Walk through this debris back to concrete here. Yeah, more crap. Actually, a lot's been hauled off. Motor in this one's bad. Not sure what's up with this here minivan. A little Buick. Caddies, got a couple caddies back here. In the old junkyard. Hmm. What is this, bugs? Stanton, this vehicle not for sale. I don't, I don't think anybody would buy it anyway. Let's see. This one old, what is this? Old Mercedes. Hammer sleigh? Okay. Yeah, it's worth buying. This one's got a gear shifter issue. Ooh, wood grain console and a bunch of flippy switches. How about that? Wow. Huh. Yep, keys in the ignition, ready to roll. Like anybody's gonna want it. Transmission in a Sienna. Yeah, that's actually I think I've said that mentioned that before. I bought a Chrysler uh, Grand what was it? Um Oh whatever it is, Grand Caravan transmission issue. Yeah, rebuilt the transmission for thirteen hundred. I bought it for five, and sold it for thirty-two hundred after the transmission was rebuilt. And ran great. Yeah, no problem selling that. So I made a nice little profit on that. But here, I don't think I'd even risk buying anything from here. Try to fix it up and flip it for a profit. Wow. And this one, I don't know why they haven't got rid of it. Just because it's got some bling blings. I'm surprised they don't try to sell those on Craigslist or something. Yeah, doors locked. As is, no warranty really. We got all sorts of crap in there. Yeah. yeah I can get on the other side, who knows? Oh, splur sport track. Yeah, back door handles broke. Yeah, this one's hey, look at that. Little door trim falling off. There's some other junk in the back. Perfect. I'm sure it's as, it's worth whatever the asking price is, including the missing keyhole. More planes flying out on a Sunday morning. Yeah, everything's all cleared out here. Oh, that's amazing. What we got over here. Oh, they still got the old Mitsubishi with its custom ugly blue patches all over it. I don't know what the deal is with this? Why they haven't got rid of it? Cause it's a hunk of junk as well. Looks like they cut the grass. Boy, that's good. Got some tars. Big old expedition with some bling blings. Oh, evil. Yeah, I'm sure it's worth buying. Box truck they've had for ages. I don't know what the deal is with it. Looks like they got some more on the wrecker up there that they're hauling off for scrap. That's where a lot of this crap needs to go. I would say most of it. But again, that's just my opinion. So I can get a shot inside the cage. They haven't cut the grass over here, so I don't want to 
get bit by anything, but yeah, we'll use the old something the old rig I guess for hauling vehicles Maybe another Dodge minivan a caddy yeah. looks like some scrap being hauled off old Sebring convertible key in the ignition ready to go well, unless they're bringing them in and, you know that wouldn't surprise me either Find more junk wherever they find them at. Haul them on in, hoping some sap will buy them. But no, no. What else we got over here? We got the old tugboat Ford. Call it that because of the rubber tire on the front bumper. Yeah, more junk caddies, stuff that I guess they think is worth selling. A Mercedes with the hood popped on it. How about that? VWs, a little Honda Fit. Yeah. 39 Fitty. Caddy. We got our Hummer over here. Now it's even worth looking at. Yeah, why not? Since I'm over here. Might not be here next week. I see some rust under it, so it could be from up north. But yeah, I see rust there too. Yep, we got a, a Hummer from up north. Yeah. H3. Let me ask you, 79 something for it? 79.50 with rust, really? Yeah, I'll pass on that. On all this crap. 1950, 4500. We got 3990 for a VW. 2500, 3950. We got 3950, 3000. That seems to be the going rate around three to four. Huh. Well, isn't that something? So, yeah, there you go. August edition of. Shady car lot. More junk, actually less junk, I should say. A lot of it's been hauled off for to be scrapped or whatever. So, how about that? Oh, nice padlock. Yeah. So, there you go. We'll just wrap up this here. Shady car lot, August edition. We've actually done a little bit of uh, summer cleaning, so not bad. Still, I'm not impressed, and I would not buy anything from here. So, <laughs> oh well, I'm gonna head on home. So until the next thrilling video, adios.